being. We we hadn't established who we were. We were still fighting to get our respect mm-hmm. in fashion. So there's a lot of fights at the same time. So we had to go and basically like intern almost up under these companies. Because you intern for Louis Vuitton at one time, yeah. right? Okay. Louis Vuitton, mm-hmm. Fendi, mm-hmm. Uh, and we interned in a way at Adidas. Mm-hmm. I like the licensing deal was my intern to become, uh-huh. you know. More in that uh, Bernard Arnault, Bezos, right. Right. Elon territory. Mm-hmm. And just understanding how to, you know, how money works. Mm-hmm. Like, this is first generation. Mm-hmm. Like, you can say, like, look at, like, Jay with the Ducey. Right. This is first generation right. wealth. Right. And learn those infrastructures, right? Yeah, the infrastructure is how to do a factory. Even right now, like, when I left Gap, I moved, uh, we made this T-shirt, like, all the tremendous stuff we're doing right now, which is a flip on Supreme, where... Mm-hmm. Uh, the guy that used to work for me, mm-hmm. uh, Tremaine, mm-hmm. is now at Supreme. Mm-hmm. Um, and, you know, uh, we can go further into that uh, a little okay, bit later. later but no for the problem. main point is, so I took it over to Dove Charney at L.A. Apparel. Mm-hmm. And he used to, he founded Los Angeles Apparel. So then uh, we made the White Lives Matter tees. Mm-hmm. And then when I put up the, the tweet, now nah, he, ain't, he ain't releasing the tee because mm-hmm. he's Jewish. Mm. And I'm like, see, this is my exact point that I'm mm. making. Mm. Like, Jewish people have owned the black voice, mm. whether it's through us wearing a Ralph Lauren shirt or it's all of us being signed to a record label or having a Jewish manager or being signed to a Jewish basketball team mm. or doing a movie on a Jewish platform like Disney. Mm-hmm. And we understand it's like I, I, I respect what the Jew, Jewish people have done and how they brought their people together. Mm-hmm. You know, they came into money uh, through the lawyers mm-hmm. when uh, after Wall Street, when, um, when all of the, um, like the Catholics, they wouldn't, they wouldn't divorce people. Right. So the right. Jewish lawyers came and they were willing to divorce people. That's when they first came into their money. So like, say, with me and Jay, with our, our culture, mm-hmm. with the... With the darker Jews. First just, of all, because you got to... It just happens when anybody starts talking deep. Okay. <laughs> yeah, yeah. Yeah, with the, yeah. Dark, with the darker Jews, the 12 lost tribes of, mm-hmm. of Israel, who we mm-hmm. are, because we Jewish also. We're from, right. we from Africa also. We're the blood yeah. of Christ. So we're not just black. We are Jew, just like the Jewish people. And now we're coming into money. But the main thing is, I got to drink the Duce over the Hennessy mm-hmm. as the first step to us coming together like how the Jewish people came together. Mm. But we couldn't even talk about, I remember Ben Horowitz called me after 444 and said, I don't know about Jay giving up business, Jewish business secrets. Mm. And these secrets- said, we, we were talking about um, building up uh, uh, the, the properties and stuff like that yeah, on 444. These secrets can't, they not finna be a secret no more. Like if somebody mm. tells me something, they like, yo, I want to tell you this, but it's a secret. I'm like, I'm not your personal hard drive. <laughs> like, if you want to be a secret, <laughs> don't tell me. <laughs> I'm not here to keep nobody's secrets because right. it's only the truth that's going to set us free. And what they do is the Jewish community, especially in the music industry, they'll take, in the entertainment period, they'll take one of us, the brightest of us, right, that mm. can really feed a whole village, and they'll take us and milk us till we die, and then Stevie Wonder's son got to get a job, mm. right? But... Camera Azoff got a job at Apple. He, I right. mean, he, he's already set up right. because of the way Azoff is connected. And we have to make our own connections. That's what I saw. What I loved about it, I preach, I love mm. Dove just as a human being. As and this is the guy from Adidas? Dove is from right. American Apparel. Okay. But I'm talking about put out my White Lives Matter tee. The White Lives mm. Matter tee, don't say nothing. Mm. I'm like, put it out. And he's telling me like, yo, I want you to visit the Holocaust Museum. And I was like, yo, I want you to visit Planned Parenthood. That's our Holocaust Museum. Uh, mm-hmm. I'm like, yo, I put my life on this uh-huh. at this point. Because they've been fucking with me too long. Mm-hmm. They, put, they put the crazy narrative out there. My Jewish trainer, Harley Pashenak, who's Lizzo's trainer, right. uh, put it out when I went to the hospital, put it in the press. Oh, I got wow. a bunch of friends that went to the hospital. It didn't go to the press. They did that just like they did in the documentary on the third episode to okay. say, we love Ye like the rest of y'all. We know he a genius like the rest of y'all, but sometimes you got to turn the camera off on them. Right. So they'll go and get a dude that's supposed to be my friend that's been taping me the whole time and buy this nigga out for $30 I, I million. You dollars. Co- I thought you co-signed that. 
I ain't co-signing, but oh. you you get used to that. Paparazzi taking a picture of you, you ain't getting no money off it. Right. You just get used to getting screwed by the mm. Jewish media. Mm. And I'm saying, y'all done poked the bear too fucking long. When I wore the White Lives Matter tee, they, I had four SoFi Stadium shows. They canceled my shows. Mm-hmm. I said, it's up. And let me tell you one thing. It's like if a black man is caught with some in the car or something, everybody in the car going to go to jail for, with him, right? But if a black man can play basketball or rap, only he gets the record deal. So meaning like if one black man does something bad, all the other blacks get caught with him. Right. If one black man does something good, nobody else gets nothing with him. It's a reverse for the Jewish people, right? right? If if a Jewish person could repeatedly fucks me on a deal, it's right. just them. It's just the businessman. It's not the people. It's not nobody else. Right. But if a Jewish person does good, all of their people eat with them. That's one of the flips. I got to tell you something. Where is a black guy that has a Jewish person signed to him? Point it out. Tell me that. Mm-hmm. Where is a black person that's signed to a Jewish person, all of them, basically 90, basically 90, uh, 90% of them. So what I'm saying is y'all done poked the bear too many times. Y'all should have learned with Drake. Y'all should have learned with Puff. Y'all should have learned with Hove. Y'all dealing with a different kind of animal here. You know, everybody wants to say I'm 730. Well, I'm gonna use that to my advantage. I told y'all I was the leader. I told y'all I'm going to free my people Mm -hmm. in the name of God, and I will put my life at risk. Because if I wasn't in a glass prison, just like Larry Hoover's in a real prison, then I would have had to say so when my kids go to school. I go into my kids' school, I see Hanukkah books, then I see Kwanzaa. Christmas is Christ's mass. Where's Jesus in the school where all the celebrities are paying for their kids to go? I'm sorry. Like, Like a... Like, hey, I'm talking about Right. But ain't nobody yeah, listening yeah, to me right, type right, shit. You know right. what I'm saying? I'm in like a glass box of like right. celebrity with a bunch of handlers around me and shit. Right. And people colluding behind my back and being like, is he ramped up? What right. we going to say now? What I told y'all, because I talked to Larry Jackson last night and he was like, yo. From iTunes. Yeah, but now he's got his own deal. He said, he started telling me how Clive Davis changed his life. Mm. And I talked to him for six minutes. He said, well, usually we talk back and forth. I said, Larry, this is my life, though. Mm -hmm. I'm letting you know so you can let everybody know what it is. Mm -hmm. What it is at this point. You Mm -hmm. know what I'm saying? It's like, I'm not afraid. Mm -hmm. I'm not afraid of y'all no more. And we don't have to be afraid. I understand that they got us so paid off every which way they cutting out. And my whole point just off the tweet, the fact that, what does that even mean, what I said? And the fact that I got taken off proves my point. Jamie Lee Curtis went on TV and said, I hope they take his children away from him. I hope they take his children away from him. The thing is, you know what? I love everybody. Mm -hmm. I love, but right now I got something against the Jewish people as a whole. But why as a whole? But why as a whole? As a whole, because that's the thing. They're gonna teach their kids to do the same thing that they're doing to us, right? They're hiding the information from their other Jewish brothers. They're putting us down. They're, They're celebrating this movement that kills. 50%, 50% 50%, 50% of us is abortion. But what is the Jewish abortion rate? They don't kill themselves. Child rebel soldiers in Africa get doped up and psyched out and made to kill their parents. In America, we get doped up and psyched out and made to kill our children. Made to kill our children, that's a very common thing. My dad wanted to abort me because that's what, we, what we've been taught. I was taken away from my dad. You know what I'm saying? So it's like everybody, they put out triple X, Tupac. That's what Larry was saying. Right. My response was, well, I guess I'm next then. Right. Because it's no backing down at this point. I talked to Q because Q been labeled an anti-Semite. First of all, we are Semite. We right. Jew. So I can't be anti-Semite. Right. First of all, I need my four stadiums back. The 78 media outlets that called me abuser when I was trying to get that heroin addict away from my kids that was tattooing my kids' names on them, Skeet, right, right. Pete Davidson, right. they popping up. You know what I'm saying? It's like they, uh, Trevor Noah, not even from America. Right. He just looked black, right? right? 
uh, gonna tell, gonna say, yo, Kim, it's gonna get dangerous. So they putting all that, he crazy. He's so OJ. Right. My, Nori just want the family back together. Right. I just want the family back together. Right. Kim is a Christian. On TMZ, I just saw yesterday, they said, Pete Davidson and Kim have sex by the fireplace to honor their grandmother. It's Jewish Zionists that's about that life, that's telling this Christian woman that has four black children to put that out as a message in the media. So when I drive by and I see the Hulu ads and I say the J.P. Chase Morgan ads, I'm gonna let y'all know right now, the devil is a defeated foe. You can't poison me, and by the way, Y'all done already fuck with me so much. Y'all already black mirrored me. You already made everybody think I'm crazy. You already took my family away. You already separated all my friends. I don't got no celebrity friends. Because when I was on TV, on Instagram saying, I don't know where my child is. And the Kardashians kidnapped my daughter in public. And I didn't have the address of my child. None of these niggas that want to say something Travis now. Travis gave you the address, though. Travis gave me the address. Right. But as far as Meek Mills, no. Puff Daddy, whoever, none of these niggas. All you fake hard niggas, fuck you. Wait, Come, wait, no, no, wait. hold on, hold on. Okay. All you fake hard niggas, fuck you. Right. You know what I'm saying? So y'all niggas shut the fuck up about me. Now let me say it calm. You niggas shut the fuck <laughs> up about. You shut the fuck up about Michael. Right, right. I'm Michael now. Right, Every right. Michael you can think of, right. but mostly Godfather Michael now. No, no, no. I'm Michael now. <laughs> I'm Michael right. now. I am the richest. Right. Right. They say you're the richest black man in American in, history. In history. In American in history. Can we make some noise for that? God damn it. Yeah. Come on, man. So I want y'all to I want y'all to run up on me. No. I want I want y'all to come kill me. No. I want you to smack me. No. I want you to do all the shit you rap about. No. All, hold on, no. all the shit you rap about. I want all the shit you rap about. I want you to come do it now. Come down to this joint right now, please, please. Or otherwise, shut the fuck up. Unless you was there when the Kardashians kidnapped my kids. You understand? Now go and get y'all some motherfucking business while we go and get free. Cause I'm Moses out here. You know what I'm saying? I mean, um, mm -hmm. I I want to be careful with this subject because wait a second. But tell me, mm -hmm. could you even really run this interview? Cause Mav yeah. didn't run my interview. Right. You know what I'm saying? They blocked me out. The Jewish media blocked me out. This shit lit, right? I'm lit, right? Mm -hmm. I'm lit. Yeah. I'm lit. You know what I'm saying? J.P. Morgan. I put 140 million dollars yeah. into J.P. Morgan and they treated me like shit. So if J.P. Morgan Chase is treating me like that, how they treating the rest no, of y'all? that's outrageous, Shoot. yeah. And this, this murder was for Chase accounts. Yeah. That's what I'm saying. I am outraged. Mm -hmm. By the time, people always, they want to calm it down. Because no matter what, you didn't yeah. break no law. I didn't break a law. No matter I didn't what, break the, a law. the bank shouldn't be a judge or jury on right. anything that's but going on. But this is, right. it's like a social contract. Candace Owens has a word for it, I'm forgetting. But it's basically like, they told Candace Owens she couldn't hang out with me. You know, I'm here because I ain't have no outlet. I was on yeah. Tucker Carlson, right? right? And people, Trump supporters, they think it's so, you know, they think it's nice that a black guy supports Trump. But yeah. it's like, would they really support me once I, when, I, when I do? Because they said legally I'm not allowed to say what's happening in 2024. Mm -hmm. But all those people that love me when I run against, when, when, I, when I wore the hat, right? Would they... Would they support me? Now, I got to say something about the hat. That's one of the things that really drove me to the edge. Some of the MAGA hat. The MAGA clear, hat. Right? Imagine your own wife telling you, oh, the hat, small dick energy. Meanwhile, the Clintons got them trying to get people to get vaccinated. Mm. I know somebody, I'm not going to say his name, where Kim and Chris got on the phone with them trying to get them to push the vaccination to black people. Meaning that's how in tuned and how aligned with the Clintons but, that the Kardashians were through Corey. Oh. Through Corey. Corey is a plant. He's there for the agenda and controlling the power of that family. Three of that, three, four of those people in that family have been raised Christian by Rob Kardashian. Mm. I know y'all want to question, but uh, did no, you no, ask no, something I mean, right there? Ahead, man. <laughs> yeah, but you, I think you just got to yeah. let some of this yeah, out. Yeah, so yeah. Yeah. It's, it's, not, it's not even... Venting or inventing, it's just, it's up. You know, they didn't, they didn't fuck with me too long. Every time they say my name wrong, it's like they calling me Cassius. 
Mm. My name, Ali. Mm. If I mm. change my name, you respect that I changed my right. name. It shows you the level of disrespect. Every time they say one of my outfits are bizarre. When the last time you read a headline and they called me a billionaire? For three years, Forbes wouldn't say I was a billionaire. It's all to diminish me so y'all wouldn't listen to me. So mm. say when I did the Ye and Drake show, right? Mm. It's so funny. I look up and it say Ye, D-R-K, right there. But uh, I just, oh, I look, it's, it. It, it, it's just a similarity to it. you dyslexic like me? I'm, I'm dyslexic. Yeah, absolutely. Gemini dyslexic, left-handed, made to be right-handed so okay. I could fit in. Okay. Um, okay. <laughs> all right. That's all right. All right. Yeah, continue. All right. All right. I'm gonna, I'm gonna take another shot. I'm gonna be honest. Okay. Yeah. This is a lot. This is a lot. Yeah, only, I'm gonna be honest. Only, only to do say. Yeah, okay. Only to do say. This is this is beautiful. Yo, mm. think about like Nike. Nike is as popular as Apple, but it's company number 321. Apple's number one. App, Nike's on defense. It's Whoa. not on offense. Whoa. Right? Because because niggas love Nike. Right, so Nike is used for political influence because it's not about the money you make, it's about the position you have. Mm. So when they signed me to Gap, it wasn't to raise a stock price, it was to be able to be like, to tell the Fortune 500 companies that do deals with China, to tell them, hey, Gap has influence in the underserved communities. Right. That was what I the deal was about. That's the girl part. Not you. The same reason why I was in a Kardashian situation. So you would but, feel... But, but hold on, yeah. let me ask you something. Because as a person mm-hmm. that when we first seen the Gap deal, right? Yeah. Um, we understand that, that, that rich motherfuckers ain't going in the Gap. But you yeah. know what? They was going in the Gap because of you. Mm-hmm. They was going to, and they said, powered by Balenciaga. But then you walk into the to the store and then there's these clothes that's just on the floor. Is, the that, bag, is that degrading the to somebody that's rich that want to come in there? 